slide you over. There we go. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, right off the bat. Makima. What a great start to the stream. Oh, when did I take- when did I get a a, 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 a ice thing? Oh, hey, Chrysalis. My f one of my favorite homos right here. How you doing today? Aside from being gay. Which, you know, I expect you to be every day. Otherwise, I'd have to, like, ban you or something. down. No, you're not my- you know how many homosexuals watch me, Crystallis? You're insane in the membrane if you think you're my favorite. Gosh. Can't believe this guy. The ball's on this guy. I'm thinking he's my favorite homosexual. Look, Crystals, you're great, you're great, but I mean, you know, there, there are other fish in the sea, you know what I'm saying, man? It can't always be you that's in the spotlight. Hey, Majima. Go in the trash where you belong. Exactly. You gotta you gotta wash away the pain. I think this might do him in. Ah, uh, no, not quite. Ooh! That was an uppercut right there. That was pretty poggers. We encountered him like, like, like as, literally as soon as I went outside, Majima was right there. It was pretty epic. Hey Teague, this is indeed the gamer area. You have made it. Hope you're doing well today. So yeah, we got everything that needs uh, 50 experience. 
Let's, uh, I don't know, clear out body? Why not? Good body next. And we can head right on back to Smile Burger. Should be able to buy those last two items, so we'll have Smile Burger all cleared out. Oh, not to go. Speaking of, I went to Wendy's for uh, for lunch. Yeah. While we're uh, speaking of burgers and whatnot. <laughs> and the last thing, a smile burger combo. <laughs> and with that, we have completed smile burger. Quite frankly, probably the greatest achievement we've done in the game so far, completing Smile Burger. Nothing, no, nothing else can compare. Uh, what do we got over here? Oh, the Gangbusters, maybe? Oh, well, the, the fake cop thing, yeah. Yeah, let's try to find him. Uh, yeah. Big cop. Uh, 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 hey, there he is. Yeah? Oh, get fucked. Get fucked. Oh, he's got a gun. Menacing man. <laughs> Taken out just like that. A lot of these, like, sub-stories that, like, were available early on were probably just going to be able to breeze through of their fights. Ooh, yeah, I know. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Hey, Rhea. Yeah, uh. you do that. I know you have all your finals coming up, so I get that. Mm -hmm. Oh, sorry, Chris Sauce. I didn't realize you were busy being beautiful. I'll make sure to not ask you to do anything. Don't want your gorgeous face to be distracted or anything like that. Ooh, we completed 20 sub-stories. That's pretty, pretty boggers right there. Prevent all damage in the form of resist guard in heat mode. That's pretty cool. Uh, let's go up this way. So there's another uh, boost damage that way. Oh, I believe you, Crystallis. I don't think you're one to uh, shake those kinds of responsibilities. Majan I do not know how to play Majan at all. I think I like tried once and I was just like completely lost. Oh yeah, Club Sega. We can uh actually I wonder if the guy that wants to do the, the crane game is still in here. Hmm? Yep, he's still here. Oh, what are those? Whoa. 
What do you want? Yeah, no problem, Sasaki. The entire Wufam series. Axolotls. Oh yeah, it's like the thing that Mudkip's based on, I think. Woo Papa, Woo Mama, and Little Woo Kun. Wants all three. Alright, you know what that means, right gamers? We're gonna be playing some crane game. All right, let's do it. The secret is for grabbing these, like where's the sweet spot? Oh, oh, first try. Yo, first try. Pretty epic. Okay, so that's the Wu Mama. I'm guessing that's the dad. I wonder where... Do I have to, like, come back in and, like, the baby one will be here? Those all look the same. I think those are all the Wu Mamas, too. Oh. Oh, still went in. Let's go. Wukun. See, I think these are like, yeah, these are separate. Makes you think of uh, Super Monkey Ball. Didn't even grab it. But th that does look in like a bit of like an optimal grabbing position right there. See, now it's like in an awkward position because of that thing right there that stops it from falling down. Hell yeah, we're getting some monkey balls here, Crystallis. What else is a Yakuza to do? Yeah, that's not gonna grab it. Heck. Where's Sonic and Knights? I don't know. We'll have to find out. Next time on Dragon Ball Z. There's Sonic right there. Sonic.
Oh, isn't this your game here? Dragon Treasure, whatever. Oh, yeah. Oh, that's some weeb shit right there. Is that something you're into, Chrysalis? The Key of Avalon? That looks like a Chrysalis thing. Anyway, I'm all about the about the boobies over here. Skies of Arcadia? Yeah, I don't think we got that. The entire yeah, so we need the other one. Mm. Change the UFO. Oh, interesting. Wait, no. I don't want I don't want the chonky birds. We don't need the chonky bur we don't need the chonky burbs. Possible dab? I'll give you a dab. Bam, dab. Oh, there we go. Okay, so that's... <laughs> is that the dad with the fucking cane? I love it. It is. Good luck, dad, for me in the crane game and for you in your finals. It's like, it's like a multi-purpose dab. Oh, it's leaning back. Got it right by the neck. Oh, it's tilting, tilting a little bit. Oh, we got it. That is epic. This is what real Mafia members do. They play the crane game. Of course we're gonna give it over. I don't know how much he's gonna pay for this. 30,000 yen, take it. <laughs> And we can also go back over here. Uh. Rock, scissors, paper. So we do paper, rock, scissors. Paper, rock, scissors. Paper, rock, scissors. Don't forget, chat. Paper, rock, scissors. Paper, rock, scissors. These moves. Paper, rock, scissors. That's us. Winning gamers, our Empress Cicada is too powerful. Oh, powerful. Do I just win because I'm too strong? I think I just won. Yeah, I'm too strong. Insect Proverb 22. Open up a can of worms. 
Don't cause trouble for other people. Leave the cans unopened. Good life advice. So we get to win a mini game, and we get to learn a little bit about life. And another sub story down. Oh, he's back. Okay, what do you want this time? Squirrels? <laughs> Jumbo chestnuts. The blue squirrel. Okay. Alright, let's do it. That one looks a bit... This one looks a bit tough, because it's got a very skinny body. I feel like the strat is to, like, grab it and try to, like, push it over. Hey, hey, what's that one doing? What? What? No, look at that. That's bullshit. Look at that. What is this? This is rigged. Literally rigged. <laughs> it's like, how? Oh, I'm mad. It was going to fall off, too. It's going to fall off. And then that happened. What is that? <laughs> Has that ever happened to anyone else? This stuffed animal clips through the, the floor? Oh, okay. Maybe this is going to work out, after all. Okay, yeah, we still got it. I still have one game, so you know, might as well. I know, it's even bad when I defy the laws of physics and your toy just gets stuck in the stuck in the little floor like that. I know, they could be so addicting too, right? I know there's a couple where it's like, you're guaranteed to win. At least like, I saw some of those when I was in Canada. Those are definitely worth playing. Hmm. Wait, so neither of those are... Huh. I guess that's just regular chestnut. Maybe if we uh, reload, it'll be the one we know the one we want. Oh, Majima! Where are you, bastard? Oh, pick that up. Oh, it's Cop Majima. Oh yeah, we should have a couple of... Oh, do I have to have the equipped though? Yeah, I don't know. I, I went to um, Niagara Falls specifically. I don't know, like, if it depends on where you... It's like, I feel like I don't really see the play till you win often here in the U.S. A 
Oh, you went there too? Did you go to that one restaurant that's like... It's like a tower, and there's like... Like, the dining room like spins around while you're sitting there. We went to that, and I thought it was like the coolest thing ever. I was blocking that. Oh yeah, they're really cool. I'm like, they exist like in a couple of places, but I, I love the whole gimmick of the rotating dining room. It's like so cool to me. Italian place. I don't think I've been to a proper Italian restaurant in a long time. I mean, I went to Olive Garden, or like, I got Olive Garden maybe like a month and a half ago. But I don't count that as like a proper Italian place. This is like a king restaurant. There was one really nice place when I used to live in Florida. It was called the Mona Lisa, and it was like a family-owned Italian restaurant. Really good. Kind of expensive, but like, really good. Do I have health items? Oh, I don't. Okay, I gotta be careful. Oh, no, he's gonna kick my ass. Yeah, there we go. Oh, you stole the breadsticks. I feel like stealing the breadsticks at Olive Garden is like a... It's a thing you gotta do. You can't just like, not do it. Well, you know, him kicking our ass means we can go eat somewhere. Pronto? I don't think we've been to Pronto yet. Yeah, it doesn't look familiar. New restaurant. Combination. Could be tear prompto. You're not wrong, we should. <laughs> and getting a little bit drunk too.
Spicy Hawaiian, that sounds good. Spicy Hawaiian sausage. I'm making some of the uh, pasta vizul for dinner tonight for uh, me and my roommates. Pretty excited about it. Oh. Oh, we need to, uh... We need to go buy food, though. Actually, how far away is the drugstore? It's right there. Uh, no, we, we can fight random thugs like this. Hungry, go get food then. If you're hungry. I'm kind of hungry too, but I'm just gonna have to wait it out. I got some like of those like microwavable pancakes when I went food shopping earlier. Really smart decision on my end, to be honest. I love those things and they're so convenient too. Yeah, shame I say. Oh shit, is it Mother's Day soon? I, I always forget about it. I'll have to like call my mom and be like, hi. Happy Mother's Day. Alright, let's go down to the pawn shop. Celine, hi. Hope you're doing well. Good to see you, as always. Yeah, pawn shop is down here. What is this? Oh, the Hanagata building. Hey, more people that want to fight. Oh, these fights are awesome. I love fighting Yakuza. I swear you we get to do things like this. And just, you know, break a motorcycle off someone's head. A classic fighting move, I do it all the time myself.
Oh yeah, so here is the pawn shop. But I think I can sell some of these like random items I've got, like the iron plate and whatnot. Yeah, sell something. We'll sell that because we don't need it. Oh, I don't want to buy anything. What do we do? What do they have? Snipe? We cannot even afford that. Oh, interesting. So basically, here's a place I could get, like, weapons and armor if I wanted to. Paper play, we don't need chestnut to squirrel. Iron scar, lifestone. Gum. Now we can get a lot more Stanima stuff. Have you been to this one before? I don't think so. Oh, all we can do is drink. Trails of cold steel. No, it's uh like Trails of Dragon or something that Celine likes. Dragons of Arcadia. Oh, there we go. That's a jumbo one right there. That is that is a big chonker right there. Ah, oh, damn. Also, hey Kiara, hope you're doing well today. I get a shout out for Kiara, please. Probably not Crystalis, Crystalis is too busy being sexy to do moderator work. So I think you gotta do it, Celine. Damn, I just knocked that one over. Oh? What? Nah. Nah. <laughs> what is that? Oh, I'm holding up. Yes, yeah, so we need to be able to differentiate between the two of you. I used to open PDF files. The fours. Oh, I'm doing pretty good. Can't really complain about much. Did a little bit of food shopping earlier. Making some uh, pasta fazool for dinner. Just doing various side quests and kind of like just experiencing the world at the moment. It's, it's like touching it and going right through it. That's BS. Pasta for a fool. 
Oh, Chrysalis. Always the jokester. Oh, we're definitely getting it. It's just a matter of believing in myself. Yeah, no, I think it's, like, physically impossible for me to get it, because it's just clipping through. But look at those big, chonky birds over to the right, though. That was the first one we had to get for the guy. Yes. Heck off, Crystallis. So rude to me. Speaking of rude, we're... Hey, a Shangri-La, we got that. Damn. Wrong ones. You change out the machine. Power. Hey Doc. Hope you're doing well. Damn it, not the ones we need. Useless. In the immortal world words of Dio, useless. Nope, just Tonky Birds this time. Come on, give me the squirrels. Need the squirrels. Ah, uh, he's just fucking with me at this point. <laughs> You're hungry? You know, like, I'm hungry. Rhea's hungry. We're all just, like, talking about food and being hungry here. This guy! Put the fucking squirrels! Give me the squirrels! I'm about to make frickin' lose it. Okay, there we go. Oh, look at that. We got two jumbos to go for this time. I think we just go for the one right out in front. Oh, look at that. Okay, that's interesting. We, we like knocked them all over. When a mom does a Ramadan, it's called Ramamadan. <laughs> oh my god. I hate it. I love it, but I hate it. Ten more to go. I believe in you, Kiara. You got this. Uh, grab the chonk by the tail. Pfft, look at that one right there. Okay, we got it. Jumbo chestnuts.
Oh, you know it, Ray. I'm, I'm pretty nutty. Give him the toy. Uh. Oh, ho, 50,000 yen. <laughs> And you know he's not done. There's, there's, he's gonna want some more. But yeah, I think for today, I'm pretty much just gonna mess around with like various side quests, and then I think tomorrow we're gonna try to just plow through um, the main story, which we should be able to do. The tale of how I succeeded the legendary crane game. That's a corn e pun right there. Huh? Hi. I need that one from an important deal you gotta get back to. Huh? Gotta get its scarf. Uh, yeah, we do want to fight you. See, it's, this is always how it ends. Somehow, we gotta fight someone. And bam, like that, we win. Took a break in the middle of a deal, got distracted, and staff took your stuff and put it in a UFO catcher. So we tried to get it back, this weird businessman here wouldn't budge, we tried to grab it when it finally came out, but then you stopped me, today's the worst. I wanna get back to this. A locker key. Huh, alright, we got the key. We can do some investigating. <laughs> and thus ends the crane game. Only a thousand experience from that? That's as rigged as the crane game itself. Alright, let's uh... Go to the drugstore, buy some drugs, and then make. Because uh, we also have like a fair number of keys too. I've collected since we last went there. Ooh, honey bee. When are we playing a real game? They're playing a real game right now, Celine. A real good game. <laughs> See, I made that into a pun. Yeah, we haven't really done much with Dragon Mode, have we? Probably fight more now. Ooh! Majima. Ooh. 
Yo, do your chan. Oh, he's got the bat. I guess there's like no items for me to pick up down here, and I'm noticing. Kind of been a fortunate place to fight him. He sprayed batty. You really took a swing with that joke there, didn't you? Really hit some home runs. We'll get to third base. Maybe we gotta go back to the batting cages for that. Speaking of, we still gotta be Majima in bowling too. Because he's still there, and we had an even game last time we played. You know, Majima might top, but I feel like he's also, like, capable of being a bit bratty, too, you know? I feel like that fits his character. Especially with Kiryu. I hate how much health, like, I feel like I must be doing something wrong because it's like I never get enough time to, like, go over to it. Wow, today really is this roast crystal today, isn't it? I'm here for it, though.
Are we are we going to talk about uh, are we going to talk about wife guy again? Oh, good memories of wife guy. Kick them in the nuts. The story? Yeah, go ahead and tell the story. <laughs> Wife guy is like a uh, like a meme guy from way back when we were watching Hell's Kitchen. And it was it was something. Okay, so basically, back when we were watching uh, Hell's Kitchen, we we had a guy who was around for maybe like three or four, well, maybe maybe a little bit more. But um, it eventually got to the point where he would always say like th these kind of like odd things. Uh, so so basically, he, uh, according to him, anyway, if this is even true, so. He lived in England, and he had a wife in Romania, and he, like, didn't... I think he, he, like, didn't have a job, but he, like, gambled or something to make money, and... He would say, like, he, he, he'd say things, like, he'd be like, I can't be racist because my wife is Romanian, when he would say something that was, like, kind of questionable. And, and, like, he never really said anything that was, like, that was, like, that bad. But, like, it was just, like, the random little things, like, here and there. It was just kind of like, eh, what is that? And so, uh, eventually, it got to a point where I, I think, uh, yeah, okay, yeah, so we were watching Kitchen Nightmares, and, like, there was a guy getting really emotional at one point. I forget, like, what the exact episode was. And so, he goes on about how, like, guys can't cry or show emotion, and it's, like, not proper and anything, everything like that. And so, you know, like, I'm, I'm disagreeing with him, there are a couple of other people disagreeing, They're just saying it, that's, like, you know, a really silly mindset, it doesn't make any sense, outdated, you know, all that stuff. And then, um, and then finally, he got, like, annoyed enough, and he was like, are there even any other guys in here? And it just so happened that on that particular day, it was just like everyone else in chat was uh, was a guy. Like aside from myself and one of my other moderators who is non-binary, like everyone else is a guy, and they're just like, yeah, we're we're men and we're disagreeing with you. And uh, after that day, he never came back. We just, like, kind of got rid of him by just, like, shitting on him. <laughs> Medieval silver coin. Brass knuckles. Golden blackjack. Yeah, I thought it was kind of funny that I didn't have to ban him, just because, like, we were all just basically trolling the shit out of him. <laughs> and so he eventually, like, just got annoyed and left on his own. Royal Joker card. Modified model gun. Bust amulet. Cool striker. Ruby plates. Well, you know what? I think we're going back to that pawn shop. Yeah, it's a it's a it's a fond memory we have of the day when uh, 
we all just like took a shit on this random person. But you know, like obviously it is deserving of it. I was like, hey Y27. We are hunting mo we've had a uh, quite a few successful runs with him actually. Bye bye bye, sell, sell, sell. Whoa, seventy thousand, hell yeah. That's some hella cash. Possible dab? I'll dab for you, Celine. Because you are pretty poggers. Ooh. Ooh, I think that means I think he's hiding in a trash can somewhere. Crystallis, yeah, you get you get a little weak dab. That's all you get. Oh? Huh? Oh and shit. Huh? Oh, I do have to go buy him some, uh... Custom made in Germany, okay. 20,000 yen. Why not? Let's pay him. Let's see what happens. Uh. <laughs> Spending that money. Timid man. Oh, did we get bamboozled? Oh, we just got scammed. Then. <sighs> Glasses aren't covered by health insurance? That does suck. Good. Makes you think about how like a lot like um dentist like uh like dentists and all that aren't and like oral hygiene isn't really covered much in a lot of places. Kind of BS. Hmm. Raise your hand. I don't wear glasses. I'm not a nerd. Where are you, Majima? Where's the trash can? Oh! There he is. I'm trying to find him. We got scammed. We got we gotta go get our money back now. I know. After this, we can go to uh, another restaurant and eat. Coward. We're literally going to go find him. 
Calm down, gamers. I mean, first we're gonna go eat, but then... Oh. Hajima. Rude. Damn, he is doing the heat actions a lot more often. Have a bike, Majima. I guess I can't use those bikes? It's kinda weird. That was a weird angle, but I'll take it. I don't like fighting this one because he doesn't say Kiryu chan at the end. Like, the voice actor doesn't say it. Oh, yeah. And do some more upgrading. Make that more expensive? Can do. Let's see. Your internet's being on pog. I hate when that happens. It's like you're not. It sucks when like you want to use the internet and then like you can't because it's just like being a very on pog. Alright, and you know what? That's actually probably a good point for me to go take a, a quick break. So I'll be back in a couple of minutes.
All right, gamers, I'm back. Oh, hey, this is the uh, other yacht. This is like one of the only clips I have Jim of like Mugger's other Yakuza games. It saves time. This guy would be a good speedrunner. He's got the right idea. So yeah, food. Street gangsters. They just keep coming and coming, and we don't even know what they are. We don't know anything. Yo, hey, Lamarty, thanks for the raid. Appreciate that. How you doing today? Something just clicked in my brain. I don't know if you want to like. Really well. Came just in time to watch me beat the shit out of some street gangsters. I think you were doing some more sunshine runs, right? Hoggers. Yeah, um, today we're just doing uh, various uh, side questings once again. Probably tomorrow is when I'm going to blast through the rest of uh, the story. So today's just like messing around and doing whatever. Wait, where is the entrance to this thing? Oh, there we go. Ooh, a stash of lollipops? That sounds pretty awesome. I haven't had a lollipop in uh, quite a bit. I have, um, I have, like, a Sonic ice cream in the freezer that I need to get around to. Around the end of chapter 8, slash, immediate start of 9, so, flushed face. Oh, we're getting a phone call. Nishida. Can we dance? Who knows, I was practically a teenager the last time I danced, why do you ask? Instant Ed Aza seems to have really rekindled the boss's excitement for all things dancing. Ever since he's been hanging out just about every day at Club de Bola over in Theater Square. Wait, he's performing that tasteless dance in public? No, no, that's not exactly it. Anyway, the boss is ready for you now, sir. He told me to send Kiryu chan to de Bola. <laughs> oh boy. I I think I think we I think we may be dancing. I, I was just trying to grab uh, the card is right there, the little little red thing. Yay, paper walls. Oh, so I guess this is uh, that punk from earlier. This guy again. Imported from France, huh? Oh, caught in the lie. Oh, what's that? Gonna tease us? Don't 
Don't mess with Q, you chan. Oi. Oh, you're seeing 2020. Perfect. Ooh, earning yen is a thing too. Yeah, no problem, Celine. Thanks for hanging out. Hope you have a good sleepy sleep. Rest well, or else. I'm also just like keeping an eye out for anything that's like on the ground. You got anything to say there, bud? Oh? You know, I've noticed we haven't gotten like Majima hopping into random fights anymore. He did that like one time and he hasn't done it since. I'm a little sad. More people to fight. Uh, chapter 10? I think we're like in the middle of chapter 10. I'm supposed to go to the uh, Cabernet Club, but I'm just like basically just doing side stuff today. I Means lots of fighting, trying to find Majima, get some crane game nonsense. level up uh I might give it a shot I I I've tried to play it before like like not in Yakuza like like in uh, through other means and I didn't really understand what was going on but I will attempt it at least once Oh, we've almost spent the end. Oh, let's buy a couple. There we go. Apparently Majima wants to dance with us. Uh. 
Oh, random people being harassed? Not good. We say no to that. Oh, nice. <laughs> right? It, it, it is pretty epic of Kiryu to drink that respect woman juice. Like, on a... Not even a daily basis, like an hourly basis. Bantong? I don't know if we've uh, cleared that one out yet. Oh, wait, no, isn't this where you can play pool or you play darts? Oh no, they got a menu here. We're getting drunk. Wait, what? Oh, we can't. We're too drunk. Being taken off the booze. I still love how this game, like, if you're if you get drunk, you just like get stronger and fights quicker. <laughs> it doesn't like negatively affect you. Traffic time. Don't know if we've been to this one yet. Oh, I know, I think we have. Have we cleared this one out? Uh, we have not. Yeah, we still have two more. Oh, so we're about to clear this one out then. Heck yeah. And that is the last one. Jindako complete. But yes, on our way to go see Majima. After we fight some random street punks.
Come over here. You're just one pachinko. 